Cheers everybody, welcome back to another beer review and in this one we're off to one of my favourite brewers in Yorkshire and we're off to Samuel Smith's and we have a seasonal from them and it's quite a special one I think and it is the Winter Welcome Ale Super Smashing Rate clocking in at 6% ABV beautiful looking label it's I think it's the 30th winter anniversary there's the back side which I shall read to you great stuff it says this seasonal beer is a limited edition brew for the short days and long nights of winter the fully bodied resulting from fermentation in stone Yorkshire squares and the luxurious malt character which will appeal to a ball range of drinkers is balanced against whole dried fuggles and goldings with nuances and complexities that should be contemplated before an open fire um it says so a suggestion uh Turkey roast goose, roast beef. I feel like I should be wearing tweed doing this, doing this review. And best served at eleven degrees. Um, Samuel Smith shot horses in the snow. The horses are used to take out deliveries for five days a week. There's the horses, horses for courses. Let's crack this open. Right, we do. There you go. This was acquired from Lewis and Cooper in North Allerton. So let's see what we get. Yeah, you get nuts and berries in this. Very much so. It smells nice. It smells like a you know a winter's a winter's night's beer. Going in a glass with not very clean, but you know I apologise as always for not cleaning my glass. So, Samuel Smiths. What do I think of Samuel Smiths? I think they are bloody good. I think they are very consistent in their beers. And they are bloody good. Bloody good Yorkshire brewery. You know, Yorkshire's got some great brewers. You've got, Black, you got Feaston's, Black Sheep. You've got the Yorkshire Dales Brewery, which I'm at at the moment. Then you've got... You got oh, you could go on forever. Yorkshire is a great place, and that's me being a southerner. It's a fantastic place. Food, everything. I'm going waffling on. Being a glass, coppery, coppery glow to it. Quite a bit of carbonation going up there. I'm gonna go in, you know. So cheers, everybody. Feels like a winter beer. Definitely, there's a lot of spiciness here. There's a lot of nuts here. Walnut comes to mind. Maybe the sweetness of a cashew. Dried fruit. Yeah. Caramel, yeah. It feels like a beer against the fire. You know, having it roaring log fire, like you do. Smoking a pipe. Where we need tweed. Tweed cap. It's that type of thing going on. It's really nice. Um, this recipe they've kept for 30 years. Um, it doesn't say anything about ageing. In this, I mean, I wonder if you got a beer 30 years ago and aged this and aged the bottle and cracked it open now. Um, but going back to this, it's got the whole, all the hallmarks of a, of a winter's beer. It's got the spiciness, you could say cinnamon in a way, with dried fruit. You got bits of berry, bits of nut. It feels autumnal. Uh, more than winter really with the nuts and the berries but it is really really nice it's um i would say it's my favorite samuel smith's that's the organic chocolate stout but it's still you know a good quality beer it's a good quality beer and i think i paid about two pounds sixty for this it's worth the money and you know, Samuel Smith's, as I keep saying in this review, 
are a good, solid, traditional Yorkshire brewer, which I think everybody should try their beers. That's me saying it, so one more for the road. Nothing much else to say about this one, boys and girls, but go out and buy it. The Winter Welcome Ale, get hold of that one. It's a lovely beer. Thank you very much for watching this beer review. Please subscribe, write them in the comments, and I shall see you on my next one, which I think might be a little bit special.